Yo, 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 what it do, Croc fam? It's your boy, man, and I'm back with another one. Man, today, y'all, we got some more Croc mail in, man. So tonight, y'all, man, it's finna get real juicy, man, because I know some of y'all been waiting on this. Man, y'all see the jersey, man. Y'all know what's going down. Y'all know we got the NBA All-Star Weekend going on. So y'all know we finna get ready to dial in on the NBA All-Star collab. So, man, first things first, man, we got the Echo joints in front of us right chill, man. Then we got the Mega Crush Babies right here. Let's dial in, man. Let's open these boys up and see what we got going on, man. See what we got going on with these things. See what we got going on. Look at the peanut butter bottoms on them babies. For the ones that don't know, man, the Echo Clogs. And the Echoes, man, they been in the mix lately, y'all. For the ones that know, y'all know, the Echoes been in the mix. And these joints right here is superb. Like how they got the teams on there with the gold gibbets on them, boys. Them gold gibbets is killer. And the All-Star game will be in Utah this year. 2023 All-Star. I think the All-Star game and the All-Star weekend is... Is it this week? Uh, is it this month? It might be this month. It might be in like in another two two weeks, two, three weeks or something like that. But, man, them Echo joints been in the mix, y'all. And then right here, man, the Mega Crush Babies. Look at the peanut butter bottom on them. Look at that peanut butter bottom. And, of course, they got the gold gibbets on these as well. The Utah gibbets. Yes, sir. Man, I already knew off the muscle, man, right off the bat, y'all, that I was going to get these, man, for the ones that I already know, man. Y'all know y'all boy was uh, been playing grown-up sports basketball. You know what I'm saying? I've been playing basketball since Little League, middle school, high school. You know what I'm saying? Stopped playing in high school, and then after school, I ended up playing in the grown-up sports league. Been in the grown-up sp uh, sports league for years now. You know what I'm saying? So I know my way around the court. I love the NBA, you know what I'm saying? I'm always watching basketball, especially around the finals, you know what I'm saying? So, these right here was a no-brainer for me off through the muscle. I already knew I was going to grab them no matter what style they came in, you know what I'm saying? No matter what they was going to look like, I was just going to grab them because I love basketball, you know what I'm saying? Unfortunately, I won't be playing basketball no more, you know what I'm saying? Because of that uh, motorcycle wreck that I got into, it just messed my knee up, you know what I'm saying? So, basketball dreams is over with, you know what I'm saying? At least for now, unless my knee ended up healing down the road. But for right now, that's a... So, I'd be just being a fan right now. But, man, let's get a close-up on these boys right here. So, we can dial in on them. See what we got going on with these babies, right? Chill. Get the cameo going. Make sure I put on the flash. And here we go. Look at them boys up. Got the Knicks, the Atlanta Hawks, Milwaukee Bucks, the Suns, the Lakers, the Sixers, the Raptors. And man, look, I'm going to go ahead and tell y'all something that I don't like about these Echoes. Y'all see how they kind of fade off on the side? I don't know if that was a printer issue, you know what I'm saying, when they was hooking the shoe up. But I really kind of don't like that because it kind of make the shoe look like, you know what I'm saying, I've been wearing them and I, they brand new. You know what I'm saying, they could have worked on that. I say they should have like kind of like probably should have erased that off once they finalized the shoe because I feel like they probably sent these through like a machine, you know what I'm saying? And the machine just kind of ran off on the edge, and that's a flaw right there for me. 
I think that's something that I'm gonna have to try and get over because right now that's really, really, that's really, really bothering me right now. But man, look at them gibbets. Look at them gibbets. The Utah. And that's big. That's real, real big, man. Shout out to any of my Croc fam, you know what I'm saying? That's out there in Utah. I feel like that's real, real big for the city, you know what I'm saying? Or Utah, you know what I'm saying? For them to have something out there, for them to have something going on, you know what I'm saying? Have the All-Star game ever been in Utah before? Not one that I can remember, so I think that's going to be real big, you know what I'm saying, for Utah, for them to step through and have something like that. Look at that gold, GB. That gold, GB, oh, no. That's fire. And that boy pretty thick, too. Let you see that side. That boy pretty thick, too. Man, y'all know when I... Y'all know I love when they put the custom buttons on them joints and they come through with the gold basketball on them. Hey, look, they trying to make up a little bit because that gold basketball, man, is really doing it for me. That strap, got the white strap on there, got the black background on there. Black goods. Got the gold Crocs patch over here. And man, it's, it's, it's a beautiful thing, you know what I'm saying? I'm really loving these. I'm gonna have to get a few jerseys to mesh with these boys, you know what I'm saying? Same thing on this shoe right here. That basketball jib, but I ain't gonna lie, it's taking the cake for me. It's doing the thing. But let's slide over here to these Mega Crush joints. And I can already see, like, on the Mega Crush joints, the print came out better on these. Because you see, even though the print running off of the shoe, it's still clear. You know what I'm saying? It still show up pretty good. You know what I'm saying? So these right here, I ain't going to lie. And then I just love the Mega Crush sole. How they got that patent leather. Look at that peanut butter. Bottom! Yes, sir. And the same gibbets, you know what I'm saying? The gold NBA. Got the Utah on there. And man, that button. Look at them buttons. Them buttons just do it for me. The gold basketball just completes. It completes it, man. Gold Crocs. That gold basketball just, it just, it just do some things for me, man. It just really, 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 really do some things for me. I love that gold basketball. They probably should have put the gold trophy on there. That 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 championship trophy would have been hard. I might need to get the championship trophy gibbets. Know what I'm saying? Mega Crush back at it again. Know what I'm saying? Mega Crush been in the loop as well. They've been doing their thing as well. Know what I'm saying? This was a... This was a great duo right here to put together. You know what I'm saying? Two of the newer styles, you know what I'm saying? Both of them individually been doing their thing, you know what I'm saying? Many, many people love the Echo Claws. Many, many people love the Mega Crushes, you know what I'm saying? Despite the Mega Crushes being heavy, you know what I'm saying? Due to that tennis shoe-like sole, you know what I'm saying? That extra foam, the extra weight that it got on to them. People love them, know what I'm saying, because they stylish. I love them because they stylish. Y'all know me. Y'all know I love a stylish shoe. And I feel like with the Mega uh, Crushes, know what I'm saying, they allow me to put on whatever with them, know what I'm saying, whether I want to just be comfortable, whether I want to get stylish with them, know what I'm saying, whether I want to go out somewhere in them, know what I'm saying. They like multifaceted. And I really, really love the Mega Crush Claw, know what I'm saying. This was a great addition to the croc family along with the uh echoes man every you know how everybody feel about these echoes you know what i'm saying i call these the foam on phone joints just because they got that extra pad in there you know what i'm saying i was wearing echoes uh this morning you know what i'm saying i think i had on the real uh tree echoes and man i just love the way they bounce you know what i'm saying everywhere i go in them i just feel like I'm walking on my bed, you know what I'm saying? Time after time after time again, man. So the Echoes, man, I love what the Echoes doing. It seems like they not stopping. Like the Echoes really, really, really been on our necks lately. Like they've been dropping color after color, 
combo after combo, and this is, you know what I'm saying? I believe this is Echo's first collab, you know what I'm saying? First uh, collab way, so shout out to um, Echo's, you know what I'm saying? I think Mega Crush, they done had a, a few collabs with the Carols, you know what I'm saying? The Lazy Oaks and uh, whatnots, you know what I'm saying? But this is Echo's first collab, so I feel like that makes it important as well, you know what I'm saying? If you were seeking to get these, you uh, got a thing for the NBA, just knowing as well, like, this is Echo's first collab. You know what I'm saying? So this right here, a very special shoe in a sense. You know what I'm saying? Just being that it's the first and I'm glad that I got these. You know what I'm saying? Sometimes when I get the clogs in, I, I grow an admiration for them and I grow a different feel for them as I dial in with, uh, with, uh, with them. Which I, because I wasn't even thinking about that, you know what I'm saying, when I was getting them, that it was the first Echo's collab. But this is the first Echo collab, you know what I'm saying, for anybody that haven't been on the Echo Way. Anybody that haven't been on the Echo Way, man, you need to get on the Echo Train. Gotta get on the Echo Train, you know what I'm saying? And as far as the Echoes, you know what I'm saying, y'all know I'm a size 12. I went down to a size 11. As usual, the size 11 have been doing it for me with these. And with the Mega Crushes, Know what I'm saying? I also went down to a size 11. Reason being is because in my Mega Crush um, review, I said like the 12, the size 12, I can fit the size 12. Know what I'm saying? They fit comfortable uh, to me. But just due to being, I want to say what it's like two and a half inches off the ground. It's just like that extra look space that I love. It's just not durable when my feet so high off the ground, you know what I'm saying? That it just, that sliding back and forth is not the same as having them flat sewn, you know what I'm saying? So with the Mega Crush, you know what I'm saying? I size down and a few in my group, a few of the Croc uh, fam, you know what I'm saying? We have discussed on numerous occasions, just, you know what I'm saying? Talking about piggybacking off that review, just saying like how it was, you know what I'm saying? More likely to size down just because you want to have that, that tightness when you that high off the ground, because if you true to size and you got that space that you love, you know what I'm saying? Some crazy things might happen and I don't need, you know what I'm saying? Nothing crazy. I don't need another tweak, you know what I'm saying? Because I'm already dealing with enough injuries right now. But man, I feel like it's time for us to go ahead and get these babies on feet. So man, let's go ahead and get these boys on feet. Let's see how we rocking, man, with them NBA All-Star joints. Come through with them all NBA joints on chill mode, man, and you already know what's going down. You know what I'm saying? You see what the vibes is. You see how we coming. You know what I'm saying? All-Star weekend, we laced. We putting it in their face. We coming through. I need to see what that All-Star Weekend jersey, what that All-Star Game jersey going to look like for 2023. Might have to knock that out. Might have to knock some some type of gear off or something. But, man, y'all see what's going on. And you see how they go shooting off for them boys like that, talking about like show show. Yeah. <laughs> but, man, look. For the fam that's been rocking with me, man, y'all know where I'm finna go. Y'all know I got to get repetitive right fast. You know what I'm saying? Just because, man, like, I got to I gotta speak for the ones that don't know what's going on because there's people coming into it, you know what I'm saying? We get new fam every day, so we got to let them know how it's going so they can play. So, look, this is what we rocking with. For the ones that don't know, man, these are the Echo Claws. The Echo Claws have a tennis shoe-like vibe going on with them. I am a size 12, you know what I'm saying, for a comfortable fit, you know what I'm saying? If you have, like, this type of structure foot going on which is more of like a narrow type vibe per se you know what i'm saying i would recommend for you to size down now it have been some that have been true to size you know what i'm saying there have been plenty of them that's been true to size but the more the ones that's more true to size are the ones with more of a wider foot you know what i'm saying and that's being just due to the fact that once they size down the shoe just becomes too tight, you know what I'm saying? So for the ones that have a wide spread, I would recommend you to just stay true to size. Although you might deal with, you know what I'm saying, 
a little lint back there. You know what I'm saying? Even if you do, you got shrinking remedies that you could use. You know what I'm saying? That's just the thing is with the echoes. It seems like there's nowhere around it. I even got fam that got like half size. You know what I'm saying? When they size down, it's too small. When they size up, it's too big. So it's just like a thing where you got to uh, choose which size you're closer to. And if you still having an issue, you just got to shrink it down. But man, it's crazy. You know what I'm saying? Because this style right here is a must try. I feel like the echoes. They ain't been in the game long, but they done made a wave, you know what I'm saying? And me personally, I feel like that's just due to that foam being on top of that foam. It just gives that all like comfort, you know what I'm saying? And that's just what it is, you know what I'm saying? The real crockheads, they know what it is. Like these echoes, man, they stupid crazy. And right now we looking at the first collab, the All-Stars. And man, I'm going to tell you right now, I'm going to give these boys right here a stiff, 12 out of 10. I'm going to give them a stiff 12 out of 10, man. And that's mainly because this, this basketball button is just, it's just really doing some things for me, man. It's just really doing some things for me. You know what I'm saying? I love all the NBA teams. You know what I'm saying? Of course, I'm riding for the home squad, the Rockets. You know what I'm saying? I know we ain't been nothing in a minute. That's cool. But I'm still around with the home squad. You know what I'm saying? That just is what it is. You know what I'm saying? But I still have love for all the NBA teams. You know what I'm saying? I'm not biased against none of the teams. I just love watching basketball. Been playing basketball since legit. You know what I'm saying? So like I said, I already knew off the bat that we was going to have these on the foot. We was going to talk. We was going to dial in on these boys. For sure, for sure. Come back. With them NBA babies on sports mode. And it's time to ball. Time to ball like. Yes, sir. Man, the details on these right here, I ain't going to lie, is super sick. Now, like I said in the close-up, I didn't like how they had the fade going on on the side. But, man, I ain't going to even lie. They so spiffy. That I'm going to try to overlook that. I feel like that's on every shoe. Every shoe they probably failed on that. You know what I'm saying? The printer, how, however they run it through, it just didn't act right on that. But I'm going to let it slide, man, because I feel like the shoe as a whole is just stupid crazy. You know what I'm saying? We already established that the Echoes is super comfortable. So, man, that's just a that's just a plus plus thing. You know what I'm saying? You can rep. Your favorite basketball team, and you could do it in comfort. You know what I'm saying? That is stupid, crazy, y'all. The Echoes! <laughs> Come back through with the Mega Crushes on chill mode, and you see the vibes. You see how high your boy off the ground, man. I'm ready to dunk on something. The Mega Crush is going to have me like coming right off the ground, man. You did. But, man, y'all see what's going on with these Mega Crushes, man. Loving the Mega Crushes, I feel like these right here probably my better one out the two. You know what I'm saying? I just love that bottom, that sole, especially that peanut butter vibe is giving me with these right here. I feel like I could just throw on some jeans or something with a nice sports team shirt, you know what I'm saying? Or a collar shirt or something and just get my casual sports vibe on, you know what I'm saying? With them echoes, I'm thinking more of like a jersey type, gym type vibe, you know what I'm saying? It's crazy. Either one, you could do multifaceted things with them, you know what I'm saying? But like I say, the Mega Crush joints is fire. Y'all see what's going on, man. Y'all see that patent leather on now. See the patent leather on there. But look, let's talk about size. Let's talk about size. And like I said once before, y'all, in the Mega Crushes, you know what I'm saying? I think I have bought I have bought a pair of uh, size 12 in Mega Crushes. You know what I'm saying? And I can feel them. But one thing I can say about the size 12, I won't be doing too much walking around in them because... 
when I walk, I could just feel the looseness in them. Know what I'm saying? That little extra slack that I love is just not an ideal thing for being off of the ground. So my idea was, man, was just to go down a size in the mega crushes. Know what I'm saying? Just to have that stability. You know what I'm saying? And with these size 11s, I feel like I can do more moving. I feel like I'm more mobile. You know what I'm saying? And that's where I want to be. You know what I'm saying? Because I would consi consider the Mega Crush as a high heel type of clog. You know what I'm saying? And for men, like, m most of us, we're not built, you know what I'm saying, to walk in heels. You know what I'm saying? Or we're not accustomed to walking in heels, so it's just a thing to be off of the ground like this, to be on platforms like this. So, man, most definitely when I'm in platforms like this, I got to go a size down, you know what I'm saying? And like I said, we talked about this in some of the groups, you know what I'm saying, just having that stability. So some do size down, you know what I'm saying, some don't. For each his own with that, that's just my thing, you know what I'm saying? I like to have that grip. Like I said, I don't need that offset moment where I twist my, tweak my ankle. You know what I'm saying? I ain't always had the best of ankles. So most definitely for me, I size down with the mega crushes. And they super heavy. You know what I'm saying? So you want to have that stability with the mega crushes. But man, look at that swag on them, boys. Look at that peanut butter. Look at that. And that's it. I'm really digging these right here, man. Shout out to the NBA, you know what I'm saying, for collabing with Crocs, you know what I'm saying? Y'all know Crocs been doing big, big things lately. The NBA been doing big, big things, you know what I'm saying, for centuries. You know what I'm saying? This is a big thing for the Croc world and for the NBA. This is a plus plus on both sides of the table, and I'm just happy to be a part of this, you know what I'm saying, because I love both. You did. Come back through with the mega crushes on sports mode. And you see what's going on. You see the vibes. And my favorite feature is the b-ball. That gold joint on there is looking spiffy. Man, that is crazy. You can't forget the peanut butter bottom. Peanut butter bottom is crazy. Stupid. Man, these boys here is sick, and I can't wait till the NBA playoffs start. That's I feel like that's when I'm going to go real brazy with both pairs. That's when I'm just, like, probably start. I probably will both pairs, like, the whole time the playoffs is going on. Just mesh up different NBA shirts and different jerseys and whatnot. Man, just be all the way in the mold, all the way in the mix. Like I say, man, shout out to Crocs once again, man. For colliding with another passion, love, favorite of mine, which is the NBA. This is a beautiful thing, man. And if you thought about getting either pair, man, I would recommend you to. Because, man, you see. Ain't nothing else to say. We out of here, man. Man, once again, man. Who all knew about the NBA collab? Got to know what's going down with the NBA collab. Like I said once before, the All-Star game is coming up. You know what I'm saying? Got to have the NBA gear on. You know what I'm saying? I'm going to grab me a couple of jerseys. You know what I'm saying? I feel like with these right here, I can go jersey. With these right here, I can go casual. You know what I'm saying? It's just a beautiful thing. You know what I'm saying? And my love for the game. My love for watching the NBA. You know what I'm saying? I already knew what it was going to be with this. You know what I'm saying? Who all rocking? You know what I'm saying? Let's talk about it. Drop down in the comments. The Echoes. The Megas. Jip.